This isn't a letter of complaint. It's a proposal to be understood. We're told the movies we watched gave us warped ideas of reality. We're told our participation trophies ruined us. We're told we're losing traditions. We're getting married too late. We aren't having enough kids. We're pursuing too much higher education. We're going into too much debt. We just aren't getting it right. We're told we've ruined department stores. We've ruined bookstores. We've ruined the housing market. We've ruined everything, it seems. We're tired of being a scapegoat. We're tired of being blamed for the way the world is when we barely came of age to see what the world holds. We barely got full-time jobs before we were getting blamed for not having a good work ethic. We're doing the best we can with what we've been given. And we get blamed for being guinea pigs of experiments we never asked for. We get blamed for trying and succeeding when it wasn't the success they had in mind. We get blamed for using different words than they're used to and desiring different jobs than they had access to. But we're just trying to survive in a world that's forever changing. Our generation is the first of its kind. Children of the internet, young adults with the world literally in our hands. We're tired of getting blamed for being lazy when the job market is out of our control. We're tired of getting blamed for how we spend our money when we never judged anyone for how they spend theirs. We're tired of getting blamed for the things we cherish, the things we value. For the simple reason, they aren't the same. We're tired of being blamed for being irresponsible adults when we were never given the opportunity to fail. We get blamed for being the generation of participation trophies. But who handed out the medals? We get blamed for not knowing how to lose. But who demanded us to win? They say we don't speak up enough. But when we do, they don't like what we have to say. They say we don't understand the real world, but they don't like the world we're trying to create. They claim we don't understand, but maybe we've been trying to explain ourselves. They claim we don't listen, but maybe they aren't used to our ways of communication. They claim we don't show up, but maybe they're looking in the wrong places. We live in an incredible time where the greatest need is for us to work together, to build together, think together, create together. And remember, if you feel judged, targeted or blame, use that energy to become the change. If you feel limited, choose to be limitless. If you feel put down, use that as a way to stand up. We're tired of getting blamed for living wrongly when we're living differently. We're tired of being blamed by other generations because at the end of the day, we need each other.